Hello, everybody, and welcome to Phasmophobia. This has been the game of the year, at least for 2020, and um, I've seen so many people that I love play it, and it's it's so scary, it's so immersive, it's so fun, and I can't wait to play it for you guys, but um, this is my very first time loading it up, so I would like to put here, disclaimer, photo sensitivity warning, um, there, there's flashing lights, and if you um, are... are Susceptible, you know, you you can get seizures from um, flashing lights. Uh, I suggest you don't watch this video. Um, and uh, that's that. So uh, let's go ahead and get into it. I'm, le I'm level one. I've never played this before. I know the basics of it. You can't see their name, all that jazz. But let me go ahead and get my audio set up, and then we'll just go ahead and get right into it. Oh, I'm so scared. I'm literally playing this all by myself. None of my friends have this game, and I oh, I'm very nervous. <laughs> literally get scared when I'm not playing the game. This is like a really good game. Um. And I've never really played a horror game before. <laughs> um, I mainly just watch horror games. I'm not a horror fan unless somebody else is going through it. So this is very nerve-wracking. Um, Alright, let's not do prison. Hell no. Uh, Tanglewood Street. Okay, amateur. Alright. I'm so nervous. Okay, is there a beginner? Or is it just always amateur? Is that, or is amateur beginner? Oh my god, I can't see. I looked right directly into, um, that? Okay. I'm not doing prison ever, I think, alone. Uh, so let's go and just... I added everything that I possibly could. I literally don't have any money to buy anything anyway, so... Uh, yeah. Oh, I'm so nervous, guys. I'm so scared. If I... Uh, just, just a headphone warning. Um, just as we're beginning. Or hopefully we, uh, begin. Um, but... Headphone users, a huge warning, it's going to immerse you more in the game if you use headphones. So if you have headphones, grab them so you can get the ultimate spooks. But, um, if, uh, if, um, I scream, <laughs> and, um, yeah, it's probably going to happen. Uh, just a warning for headphone users. Um, it's going to immerse you more in the game, but it's also going to immerse you in my screams, and you'll probably blow your eardrums, so... I don't like this. Oh, we're in. I just can't move. Oh. Probably harmless. Why did you say probably harmless? Oh my god, I've only seen this on Ethan's streams of being in, like, in the game. I'm like, oh my god, I'm actually playing. I'm not just watching. Um, anyway. Objective one. Discover what type of ghost we're dealing with. Obviously, prevent the ghost from hunting. and Detect a room below 10 Celsius and five evidence of paranormal the EMF reader. Steven Davis. Alright, I got you. I got you, bro. Apologies if it's a tad laggy. Um, my computer's not obviously getting a computer, so... Okay, there's only one thing. Hopefully we don't have to go to the attic or the basement or literally anything. Thanks very much. Alright, sound sensor, total activity. I'm just kind of getting used to everything. Um, Alright, so the flashlight. How do I pick it up? Just click? Or is that turning it on? Okay, it's shift, or shift run. Shift is run, even though it's not really running. How do you pick stuff up in Phasmophobia PC? Alright, Google's gonna be my best friend in this scenario. T. <gasps> yes! My gamer skills are so good! Take the EMF. And then I'll know where everything is. Alright, okay, I really wish my friends would buy this with me. Uh, be a lot less scary if they did. Spooky. What the hell? I hate this. I genuinely hate this. Why did I buy this? <laughs> Why did I genuinely think, oh yeah, this is a good idea? What am I thinking here? And I, the fact that I'm lagging makes it ten times worse because just imagine I'm lagging, I'm lagging, and then. Oof, I forgot the key. And then just imagine like this ghost coming out of nowhere, and I'm like, oh, I gotta run, but then I lag out. And then he catches me, and it's gonna be super scary. Who would live here, is my question. Nope, I first still forgot the key. <laughs> I'm honestly just stalling. Um, 
but who would genuinely live here? I'm just gonna talk about, like, what's going on around me, because it'll make me less scared. So, um, yeah. That's gonna be what's gonna happen in all of these videos. Um, what if I just click and leave, you know? What if I just leave? <laughs> um, but, anyway, as I was saying, who would genuinely live in this home? I'm actually curious, because, I mean, look at the street. It's so dark, there's no lamps here, and I, I don't know. Why would anybody like to die here, you know? Y'all, I don't like the fact that that stopped. What up, my dude? You here, bro? Is it a push or a pull? Okay, it's a push. Was this your child's room? Oh, who, who needs that? Who needs that in their life? Hello? You here, my man? You here, my dude? You know, I just love it if you'd come out and show yourself. Uh, don't actually show yourself. <laughs> I'd love it if you um, would just kind of tell me who you are, and then I would be able to leave. And then I'd get some good content for my YouTube video. Because as a lazy person, um, I, I love doing no work. Uh, and I, I think that'd be relatable to you, sir. Not that you're lazy. I don't want to piss you off in any way, but... Um, <laughs> I'm so scared. There's cum on the mirror. I, I love chatting with you. I love our chats, but uh, I'm gonna leave. <laughs> that was so scary. I literally went into like two, three rooms, and oh my god. I don't know how people do this. I don't genuinely know how people do this. But you're a very sweet man. I hope you know that. You're, you haven't attacked me yet, and I really appreciate that. You know, it's, been, it's, it's my very first time um, in, in, in a haunted house. Not that I think you're just a, a fantasy, but, um, you know, what if you're just... I'm leaving, I'm leaving, I'm leaving. I'm done, I'm done. Let, let me out. <laughs> Grant me the sweet release of death. Oh my god. <sighs> right when I, oh my god, my heart. <laughs> I'm gonna have a heart attack from this. Oh my god, he's going up to a level two. I think he took offense to me saying that he was possibly a fake being. Oh my god, I didn't mean that, sir. Okay, I'm gonna let the activity go down. <laughs> I can't do this. It's going up to a four. If I wasn't so scared, I'd probably go in there and get some stuff on the EMF. But I'm not going to because um, I refuse. <laughs> I refuse to go in there when there's activity. Um, possess extreme strength, uh, more active around their prey, so I don't know, I don't think it's an Oni. A Yuri is a ghost that has returned to the physical world, usually purpose for revenge or hatred. A stronger effect on people's sanity. Uh, Alright, so... I don't think it's a Yuri. Because my sanity is still fine. Uh, demons are one of the worst ghosts you can encounter. Let's pray it's not a demon. Um, it's known to attack without reason. Uh, demons will attack more often than any other ghost. I have not had a uh, ghost attack at all yet. Thank the lord. Uh, shade is known to be a shy ghost. Uh, there are evidence that a shade can stop all paranormal activity if there are multiple people nearby. Being shy means the ghost will be harder to find. Uh, maybe it might be a shade. It's possible. Slow but violent ghost and will attack uh, no matter what. I can't pronounce that word. <laughs> um, it has been rumored to travel at significantly high speed when hunting. Um, a revenant will travel at high speed. Hiding from a revenant will cause it to move slowly. Uh, so it's slow but violent ghost. So it might be a revenant, and that is bad because they are probably one of the worst things that you can encounter. Mare is a source of all nightmares, making it the most powerful in the dark. It probably would have already attacked me by now. Uh, a jinn is a territorial ghost that will attack when threatened. It also has been known to travel at a significant speed. Jinn will travel at a faster speed if its victim is far away. Uh, I don't think it's a jinn. Honestly, I couldn't tell you because. A lot of this information is based on, like, hunts, and I haven't had a hunt yet. It's a shy ghost. It's a natural hunter and will attack anything. It has been known to stalk its prey until making its kill. Uh, I'll talk to one person at a time. Fear the crucifix and will be, crucifix and will be less aggressive when near one. It might be a banshee, which is also bad. <laughs> All of these things are bad, but especially banshee, revenant, and demon as well. Like, Oni is not really too bad. Even though it says it's the cousin of the demon, it's not really too bad. A famous ghost, poltergeist is also a noisy ghost. and can ma manipulate objects around to spread fear and victims. It might be a poltergeist, because it set off the alarm. Okay, 
I'm going to explain what I'm doing right now, other than pure fear, and I don't want to go back in there. <laughs> um, I'm reading it out just to make sure, uh, like, kind of try to eliminate some of my options and make it a tad easier. Um, and that's what I'm doing right now. So, poltergeist can throw huge amounts of objects at once. I have, have not seen that. Poltergeist is um, almost ineffective in an empty room. Uh, spirit box, finger pets, and ghost orbs. Uh, Phantom is a ghost that possesses the living, most commonly sum summoned by an Ouija board. Uh, it is also include fear that those around it looking at Phantom will certainly drop your sanity, uh, temporarily make it disappear. So, it, uh, I don't think it's a Phantom, because I haven't seen an Ouija board, not that, not that I've really looked, but, uh, I don't think it's a Phantom. And then Wraith is one of the most dangerous ghosts you will find. It has also known, uh, flight and can, can travel through walls. Can all ghosts travel through walls? That always confused me. <laughs> um, race almost never touch the ground, meaning they can't be tracked by footsteps. Race have a toxic reaction to salt. Sadly, I do not have any salts. A hundred sanity. Okay, so... This is the end. Spirit is the most common ghost you will come across however it's still very powerful and dangerous. They are discovered, um, hundred grads after an unexplained death. Unique strengths, nothing... Weaknesses, smudge sticks will stop it from attacking for a long period of time. Alright, so it says, I think it's a poltergeist, to be honest. So I'm gonna go ahead and go all the way down. Just in case I die, I'm gonna just put poltergeist. What is going on here? What is going on here? Hopefully, it didn't turn off any lights because the lights are like a sign to signify uh, what room I've been in and what I haven't. You know, why do I have this job? <laughs> I'm genuinely curious. Why did I take this job? Uh... <laughs> I just hear the car alarm and I just back up slowly. I just imagine my character actually going in and then going out. Um, alright. Do they have a, a, a vehicle? Yeah, I think that's just going to have to be a noise that I deal with. I wish I could open it from the outside. I really do. No, I don't understand how anybody gets into this... Uh, garage. There's no keypad. Are you here? <sighs> Deep breaths. <sighs> he's there. <laughs> he is there. Right when I said, are you here? He's like, yo, what up? I'm here. You know? I'm just gonna ask him to come out to the hallway. Just to make it easy for me. Uh, do I have the spirit box? I do not. You know what? I'm going to go back and get the spirit box. Uh, and then, hopefully, it'll just kind of say uh, something on the spirit box. Are you in the hallway? Are you here? Are you happy? Do you mind turning off the car alarm? <laughs> it's kind of freaking me out, bro. Do you like mac and cheese? <laughs> I'm so scared, y'all. I'm so scared. Please do not attack me. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm gonna have to go farther into the house. It's just gonna have to be a risk I have to take. <sighs> Alright. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm not gonna complete this. I literally just have to go charge in there. Are you here? Are you here? I don't mind if I'm gonna die. Are you here? Are you here? Are you here? <laughs> are, are you here? Do you want me to leave? I'm leaving anyway. <laughs> Literally nothing got done. Okay, I I don't think it's a spirit box. Give us a sign. Well, give me a sign. There's nobody else here. <laughs> Do you want me to leave? Are you here? Do you like to craft? Are you here? I don't think it's spirit bugs. I'm not going in the basement. That's us for sure. So, I actually need to search how to close, to, to drop it. Is it G? It is. Okay. I honestly think it's in the garage. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up this. And, uh, actually, yeah, I'm gonna pick up that, turn on my flashlight, uh, and get this going. 
Okay. Are you here? What type of pasta do you enjoy? I heard a, I heard a beep. <laughs> I'm not doing this again. I'm never doing this again. How do you place it? Please don't kill me, sir. Please don't kill me. I don't get into pain enough for this. Stop it! <laughs> Stop breathing in my ear. Your breath's stinky. Thank you. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that was fun. I placed down the thing. Let me look for ghost orbs. Oh my god, that was fucking terrifying. Oh my god, I understand why people scream. I'm like, oh, it's not that scary. It's just like, ha, ah, but it, it's so scary. Okay. Bottom line is, um, he's in the, he's in the garage. <laughs> he's in the garage for sure. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to crouch and get the EMF going. If it's EMF 5, um, we're leaving. Go in, oh my god, I can't believe he didn't kill me. I'm genuinely... Curious, why didn't he didn't kill me? Because we looked at the thing earlier, nothing pointed to the fact that uh, he wouldn't kill me when he was right on me. Literally, only if this video gets two likes will I do this again. Or like above 10 views is when I'll do this again. Are you here? EMF 2. Thank you. Why is it right click? All right, we got dirty water. Uh, that's better than we've been doing. <laughs> um, EMF two, not EMF five. I dropped it in there just in case it is EMF five at one point. Uh, but um, let's go ahead and get the. I genuinely, I went in the spirit box. I went into that room with spirit box and nothing came up. So I'm going to go ahead and get the ghost writing um, and hope and pray that we get EMF 5, ghost writing, and something else because I just want to leave. <laughs> I really want to leave. Please write in the book. <laughs> Why is he taking so long to give me any signs? He has to be in that room. He literally has to be. He has hunted me twice in that room. I literally cannot think of anything else, anywhere else he could be. I couldn't. I literally could not think of any other place he would be. We went around the whole entire house except for the basement. And I, I don't think he's, I genuinely do not think he is in the basement because he, he couldn't be. He genuinely could not be because he's hunted me so many times in that room. Alright, I'm gonna grab the cum light, as everybody calls it, and, um, I'm going to look for fingerprints. Uh, uh, and hopefully, pray to god he doesn't kill me. Fingerprints on the door. Fingerprints anywhere.
What can I say? It makes sense. What was it? What was it? Okay, I gotta see this guy for myself. I couldn't see him? What was it? <laughs> I literally... This is amateur level. This is beginner level. And I got no evidence. It was a Yuri? Don't reflect on people's sanity, but my sanity wasn't going down that much. Uh, smudge sticks. I didn't bring smudge sticks because I don't have any. Um, freezing temperatures, ghost orb, and ghost writing. He, that was his spawn room. That had to be his spawn room, right? Because he attacked me three times in it, and then he killed, and then he technically did it another time, and then he killed me in that room. It had to be his spawn room, right? Freezing temperatures. I don't have the temperature thing. I literally don't have the temperature thing. Ghost orb, which we placed in his spawn room because it had to be. There was no ghost orbs, and ghost writing, there was no writing. Okay, I'm a logical person, but that was not logical at all. I'm so confused. I'm leaving. I am leaving.